Hello! As you may have guessed, I'm at MK Irish today for their match against Crawley Green. One of the few local matches, actually, to have beaten the weather. Um, a ground I'm pretty familiar with, actually, because uh, I grew up in this area and I've played on this pitch so many times down the years, but not for many, actually. But this is in good nick as I've ever seen it, actually. And it has changed quite a bit around here, so um, I'm just going to show you a little bit around the ground. So I'm just going to make my way down towards the referee to see if I can have a quick word with him. Fingers crossed. So this is uh, Dan Statham, today's referee. And Dan actually had a novel way of passing the uh, pitch playable today. Dan, can you tell us about that? Yeah, of course. So we, uh, we did it via FaceTime this morning because it was about a 50 minute journey for me. And uh, that's what they advised. Is, uh, it weren't too bad actually for the videos. And the main bit there was you can actually see behind us. It's actually a bit off the pitch, which is the main part which yeah. is concerned. Yeah. So that's what they showed me. And then I'm absolutely happy. The pitch is pretty good today. Okay, do you, do you, uh, have you got any fears about as the match goes on it cutting up and making it unplayable? Uh, making it unplayable, no, but cutting up, yeah, that's naturally part of football and what we expect. But I'm happy with the surface there, I think it'll be a good, good game. Okay, all the best then, Dan. Thanks for your time, pal. Thank you. Cheers, mate. <laughs> MK Irish in the green and white kicking from left to right. It's a meeting between second versus 16th at the start of play. So that will determine my prediction, which is going to be 4 1 to the home side. And this is what Mike reckons. Good save, keeper. Bit fortuitous. Wake up, Crawley! Oh, good save. The keeper should have come out, I thought, but he redeemed himself. Oh, no. Oh, yes! The um, L3 and L4. Surprise, surprise, then 1 1. And as Greasy says, it's a funny old game. Anyway, I'm delighted to be joined by Crawley Green chairman in Kate, and I want to know what her thoughts are on her team's first half performance. Over to you, Kate. Thanks, yeah, I've enjoyed the first half. I think we've played good football. Um, MK Irish are a very well organised team, so I think, um, yeah, good. good yeah, first half. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I saw it as obviously the home team started like a house on fire and they created chances that we all were missing quite a few but then you started coming into it there were signs uh, that you were yeah you were threatening and you got your goal a little bit lucky obviously with a goalkeeper mistake but uh, how, do you, how do you see the second half for your team? I just hope we carry on playing football as we are and uh, I think it's anyone's game. It is indeed well thanks for your time then Kate. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, 
one lucky offside now. Great effort though. What a hit. I'm actually gutted I didn't get the ball hit in the net. have a quick view of the game from the other side of the ground. Kindly been joined by MK Irish keeper Tom Ladyman. Tom, a 4 1 win, you must be happy. Yeah, with that. good result in the end. I think, as I was saying, I think Saturday morning, obviously, think about the game. Appreciate you bringing that up. I'm uh, just wondering what the conditions were like uh, being a goalkeeper. Uh, well, I'm not sure some of you'd understand, but it's not as easy as it looks. When the, when the pitch is like this in winter time, it's you can't kick, you can't get under the ball. You, the ball's bobbling everywhere, and so it is hard. Your gloves are slippy, so you, you sort of try to do the basics as well as you can, but it's a lot harder than I think people sometimes think. But, well, mate, is it proof yeah. costly no, anyway? You came away with a score, so thanks for your time, yeah, mate. No, thank you. Appreciate that. Thank Cheers. You much. Cheers. So, to my sins, I've just come out of the bar. I've spent an hour and a half catching up with people I haven't seen for a long, long time. So, I've forgotten a little bit what's gone on out there. I do remember it was a good watch, and I definitely recommend you coming down here. I'm going to wrap up the video real quick now because I want to get home and get something to eat. So uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And next Saturday is the 16th. Not sure where I'm going to be. So any recommendations will go down well. So until then, ta-da.